Hello Universe, Josh here with you once again, codename Spaceboot1, Spaceboot number one. And um, last time, uh, last episode, I had a little bit of a rage quit <coughs> down in the dungeon, um, but I did manage to get my stuff back, and uh, I'm going to be uh, heading back down there again. Um, but before I do... I picked up a book. Um, I don't need all this stuff. Uh, yeah, that's that's probably good. Now, do I have any uh, wood? Yes, I do. Got to equip myself. Ready to go on another excursion. Um, let's see. Let's do some more torches. I know I could have got this done before I started recording, but. Well, um, equipping yourself is part of the game, so it's something that um, uh, you're going to just have to watch anyways. Okay, uh, we are ready to head back down into the dungeon. Um, now, as I was playing before, what I was doing was I was doing a lot more exploration. Oh, look, that's interesting. Squid. You know, I heard that they were supposed to drown, but I must not have the qu the updated version where they they die in in the dry land. That's okay though. Um, let's see. Yes, I know where I'm going. I'm going for. Well, let's start right here. I thought I would get iron first. And notice that. Um, no annoying uh, experience orb sounds and no annoying experience orbs in the way just plain solid um, mining you know what you see is what you get I mean I don't mind the particle effects that's fine like but um, yeah none of this fancy ringing bells for uh, weird stuff like that. Um, okay, nothing up here. I'm just gonna, yeah, light up the immediately adjacent caverns because... Um, oh yeah, I forgot I have a chest over there. Okay, well that's good. That sh that'll keep me, um, keep me going a little longer down here. Uh, and if we're lucky, maybe this episode we might just find some diamonds, but um, I'm not going to hold my breath. But uh, it could happen. The main thing I'm going to be doing is um, working my way down here and grabbing almost everything I see. So because I'm doing that, I'm going to be going slow and probably not get... Do you see it? Um, I'm probably not going to get all the... get that far down. And let's use some dirt to make a little stairway. Um, now, I am also one of these... Uh, well, I don't know any other player like this, but um, I love gravel. Like uh, I like getting as much gravel as I can and um, collecting it. Uh, I'm not going to collect it right now though, but um, later on I'm going to do basically a bunch of gravel runs and get as much gravel as I can. Um, I think the main reason, the main thing I use gravel for is um, for uh, gravel roads. I like to build gravel roads all over the world. Uh, connecting all the different areas. Um, I like to build gravel roads in the nether. Uh, and um, so, yeah, so gravel is one thing. Oh, look, I can see right out. Oh, <laughs> there's a chunk air. I was thinking, oh, that's weird. The surface is so close. It was a chunk error. I am angry with Mo Yang for that. Oh, hello. 
I need to learn to move. Well, I was going to say I need to learn to move faster, but um, I found that when recording, my um, my FPS is is pretty low, frames per second. Uh, it's a little bit of YouTube recording jargon for you, FPS. Um, I do not have a very high-end machine, and therefore, um, when I play this game and record it at the same time, uh, I don't have the same reaction that I do. At least, that'll be my excuse for why I don't kill the creepers. <laughs> Maybe I should just say I'm bad at the game. Um, but at the same time, like, you know, it's not a competition. I don't mind. I don't mind being a little bit bad at, uh, escaping creepers. Um, I don't mind dying once in a while. anything. I am still quite enjoying this lack of experience orbs. Because um, I keep expecting to see them, uh, and then I don't see them. Very nice. And then pretty soon I'll just, I'll have forgotten altogether, and I'll play as if they were never there. And also, I think it's time to eat something. Actually, that's probably what's going to limit my this particular trip, because I'm still not I'm still not a master farmer quite yet. Not in this world, anyways. I have other worlds where I have just farm after farm after farm, um, and I never run out of of uh, wheat or um, uh, bread. Oop. Okay. Oh. So I've been here? Okay. Well, that's alright. Um. Oh. That's um, that's that uh, that leg. Okay, and from here, I think I'll do a bit of iron mining. I want more iron. I always want more iron. Uh, you can do so many things with iron. Um, I've also I've designed a couple of um iron tools too, which I, I haven't actually um, coded yet, but I'm going to be using some variant, um, some of my own uh, iron items. Look at this. That's a very straight hole, isn't it? Oh, that looks like... Wow. Here we are. See? Oh, did I see a creeper? No. It's iron mining time. Chop, chop. Uh, should I go for that coal? Well, might as well, right? That's why I'm here. I hear a zombie. More iron. Good, good, good. And I hear chickens. Also good. I wonder. 
wonder if this is an area where... Hmm. I hear zombies, but I don't see them. There's another one. There's some string. I realized, um, you know, I was gloating earlier over um, all the string I got. I was so happy. And then, um, you know, of course I realized I've been to the, um, whatchamacallit, to the abandoned mine shaft. And um, <laughs> I really don't need any more uh, string after going down there. Tons from the uh, spider webs. And here's my house. Yeah, I'm maybe gonna improve that a little bit. Ooh, creeper. Hello. And there's a zombie. Ah, uh, he's not coming after me. Okay. So what do I need here? Um, five or six ladder pieces. Okay, I've got lots there. Good. What's the plan now? Oh, more farming. Yeah, i got to do more farming. Um, I have 36 of this, which that's good. Do I have anything in there? No. Okay. Um, let's see what else. Okay. We can drop that off. I should make some more torches. Um, also some extra ones. I don't need... I don't usually need more than a stack of torches. 64 torches is usually enough, but that'll do. Oh yeah, there's another dungeon to explore too. Get some more of this mossy stuff. Uh, it's alright for now. I don't need it. Um, what was I going to do? I was going to... Uh, yes, do this. Do I have any gold yet? I still haven't got any gold. As soon as I get some gold, I want to do a clock. Because... I like clocks in Minecraft. Yo! Oh! oh. <laughs> Yikes. <laughs> Gotta be careful about that. Okay. Did you ever see that commercial with the, the guy climbing the ladder? Well, I guess there's more than one. It's like... I think it's just... The, the message of the commercial is just... Play it safe or something like that. Or be safe on ladders. <laughs> Which is probably a good message. Be careful when you're on a ladder. I should put a... Torch up here too. It's funny putting a torch down in my crotch, and fortunately it doesn't burn me. <laughs> um, we now, for a lot of the structures that I build, I like to do a safety, like um, so that you know it's super safe and I don't hurt myself. I like to do like a. Um, well, either a railing or even just, you know, just surround it. But in this case, I think I'm just going to leave it like this. Um, mainly, well, this flagpole is not... Oh, gee. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Creeper. Um, this flagpole wasn't supposed to be um, a lookout. It's just supposed to be a flagpole. Um, if it was a lookout, it would, I would make it, you know, more of a tower. Uh, oh, wow. I think 
I should watch out, pay more attention to where I am. Um, what was I saying about the the flagpole? Um, it's not meant to be climbed every day. So um, up here, on the other hand, like I might, um, I've been wanting to improve my house. Um, so I might uh, make this make like an actual like a place to stand up here with a railing and everything. I generally like railings. Um, yeah, so I'm not doing a lot right now because I'm a waiting for uh, what do you call it? Um, do you see that spider? What is going on with him? I'm waiting for my iron to smelt and I'm waiting for my <laughs> wheat to grow, so a lot of waiting. <laughs> um, that's okay. That's okay with me. Hopefully, if it's not okay with you, you can just fast forward or whatever. Um, find something else. Uh, find when I'm doing something else. Uh, might be a good idea to... Well, where's the sun? Where's the sun? Where's the sun? Is it up? I think the sun is high enough. Um, I think that spider won't be hostile. Let me see. Yeah, so I'm not gonna kill him. I'm gonna be nice. Okay, well this is nice. I got a nice little cobblestone cottage in the woods. Um, those trees kind of decayed a little funny, but I think that's just part of how that works. That's fine. Uh, so yeah, there's a lot of things I won't be able to do unless I get out of this forest. Um, but in order to get out of the forest, I want to um, I want to have a like a, a good food supply that I can take with me. Um, and maybe even a bed that I can bring along. And maybe a tent. Well, I think that's too much. Like, I've tried doing tenting before, like, uh, in Minecraft and, and doing a tent every night. And um, it's very cool to roleplay uh, with a tent. Um, but it also, you know, it, it takes away a, a, you know, a fraction of the time in the morning when you could be um, you know, doing other jobs and stuff. So um, basically the way Minecraft works now is, is you can basically sleep out in the open under the stars. Uh, you can even sleep in the rain if you want, um, which I think, you know, that should probably be changed. I mean, but I guess it's not a big deal. It's not high on the list of things to change, and if you really don't want to sleep in the rain, well, nobody's forcing you to. <laughs> um, but well, I mean that's the thing. Like you'll you'll probably see like um, you'll see how I react to uh, sleeping in the rain. Like if that happens, um, it's always kind of nasty. Um, what was I saying? Uh, yeah, so I'm probably not going to do the whole bring a tent with me um, unless like I'm going on an expedition to somewhere like where I, I know I don't want to build like a permanent base, but I am going to sp spend some time there. Um, so like it's a medium kind of base. Like, you know, the, the shortest time periods I don't want to build anything like I'll bring a, I'll bring a bed maybe and, and spend the night just out under the stars um, the next level up would th from that would be um, maybe a chest or two and then from there a tent in fact I, I probably should have just done a tent here because this is really like this is not going to be well I guess I might keep it as a as a more permanent home I, I'm not sure not sure what I'm going to do with it. Let's look at this house. Well, I mean, yeah, it's a, it's a, you know, it's a fair enough starter house, but it's definitely nothing, nothing special. And yeah, 
I always do the. I wanted, I wanted to make one of my goals, like for this series, um, to uh, try and work with the landscape as much as possible, which is to say, do very little of this leveling of terrain, um, and just uh, work with what I get, um, basically. Uh, let's eat that bread. Um, work with what I get, like, uh, terrain-wise. I mean, something like this, I would probably, I would take, I will get rid of, um, like, a little tiny ridge. Um, but other than that, like, we have, like, I'll, I might just, I'll probably leave that as a slope. Leave that. What do we got here? More trees. I'm just going to keep on chopping trees. Um, yeah, the other thing I want is some uh, different color wools. I see I have yellow flowers here, which is good. I can make a uh, nice wool out of that. That's nice. Um, but I also want to get some green wool, which will require cactuses, which will require deserts, which will require travel. Um, is that a wolf? Did I see a wolf? I'm pretty sure there aren't any wolves around here. Which is, you know, I, th I thought that the, this was a good biome for wolves, but um, I guess I guess there aren't any here. Oh, the other thing I feel like doing is, is um, basically I've been wandering blind in this forest, which is uh, which works fine, fair enough. Um, but I've been thinking like if I could find that river that I saw the other day, um, I could uh, follow like make the river kind of a a track to follow along rather than just doing the cardinal direction thing north, south, east, west, uh, which is one possible plan. Um, instead of doing that, just do uh, um, just follow the river one way and then follow the river the other way. That way I don't have to worry as much about keeping track of um, cardinal directions. Um, I could make bread out of that. Yeah, I'm going to do some farming now. Oh, oh let's, do I have uh, bone meal? Yes. And do I have bones? I might have bones in here, yeah. I'm going to consolidate everything into this one chest, cause, because I can. Um, yeah, that's good. Uh, what? Are they? Okay, I'm keeping the bones, making bone meal out of them. I um, haven't used that leather tunic. What do I have? Well, I probably won't need it for a while. I could make it yellow. You want to try that? I have some yellow. There, nice yellow tunic. Should I put it on? <laughs> it doesn't look much better than my um, my uh, multicolored armor. Um, I could wear that for now. Um, oh, and I bet my iron is done. Yes, good. Um, and we'll use my seeds. Okay. Oh, and I need to start a pumpkin farm fa fairly soon, too. Okay, seeds, two, three, grow, grow. Grow, grow, uh, seeds, and um, grow, grow, grow. Let's see, have that, that, that. Um, I think it's it. I'm almost ready to carve out like a you know proper farm like with rows and whatnot and, and um, fences. Where's the sun? Sun's going down. Um, 
I think I'm gonna like uh, call this an episode uh, when the sun goes down. But I will continue on farming. Should I use all of my bone meal? I guess I might as well. Because I can always get more. Bone meal is one thing I have lots of uh, in this world because I have access to that skeleton dungeon very close to the surface and it's uh, very good. And um, do, 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 do. now I can use. Oh, is that it for the bone meal? Okay. I can use some of this wheat to um, to breed. Uh, cows and sheep. Um, I guess the rest I can eat. And yeah, there we go. Well, the sun is going down. Um, put that hoe away. Um, <laughs> okay, I should use this some of this iron now because I have it. What do I need? I need pants and a hat. Um, I don't always like to do a hat because I like to uh, keep my fancy headband showing. But maybe I'll do a hat just now. That armor is kind of ridiculous, I know. But, um, you know, I have a big long list of things to do. I kind of like the way he looks there, though. Let's see. Little tiny house. Um, there you are. Hello. Okay, uh, what else do we need made of iron? Um, hmm. Don't have any redstone yet, so I can't do a... Is that what a compass takes? Yeah, cut redstone. Um, so, I think... I think I'm ready to take a nap. Okay, so I'm gonna. Okay, well let's uh, let's decide on something to do for tomorrow. Um, I have iron. I also, you know, I have I have all that. Well, let's see how much. I'm gonna eat all this wheat. I'm gonna turn it all into bread. Well, as much as I can. Um, there. Okay, so I have that much bread. Um. I think tomorrow I might clear this clearing and, um, le well, clear this forest and turn it into more of a clearing and then uh, make that into a proper farm in front there. Proper farm. Um, not a giant farm. Like, I've done huge farms before, but I, I'm not going to do something that big right now. I'm just going to... Uh, make a modest farm, but enough to get me basically a stack of bread is what I'm looking for, which is three stacks of wheat. Um, so it, you know that'll be that'll be some work. Um, yeah, so that's what I'll do tomorrow. Clear it, clear it, make a farm. I'll need to get some more bone meal from the skeletons, uh, and um, after that, embark on some exploration. Maybe find a river.